Well, it was a big week for Qualcomm, because not only did they announce their Snapdragon 835, but perhaps geekier yet is the reveal of their Quick Charge 4.0, which claims that with just five minutes of charging, you can get five hours of battery life. Do you hear that? That's Android geeks gushing over this battery feature like Louis C.K. gushes over Cinnabons. Dude, I'm eating that. That's what's gonna happen next. You decide if we're gonna be in the paper tomorrow, but that shit's going in my face. Now, over 100 mobile devices from companies like Samsung, LG, Lenovo, ZTE, and even Google have used versions of Quick Charge. And there are over 300 accessory products like wall and car adapters, battery packs, and docking stations that also support the technology. Now, for the new Quick Charge 4, Qualcomm states that it charges smartphone batteries up to 20% faster compared to Quick Charge 3.0. At the same time, the new version is up to 5 degrees Celsius cooler, while also offering up to 30% more efficient battery life. Quick Charge 4 also uses the third version of ENOV, or Intelligent Negotiation for Optimum Voltage. This new iteration of the company's power management algorithm includes real-time thermal management. Qualcomm called this a technologically industry first and claims it offers advanced charging optimization by automatically determining and selecting the optimal power transfer level for a given thermal condition. I know, non-geeks be like <laughs> That just means, at least so they claim, that the phone will be able to cool itself down if the phone starts to overheat. Little not so subtle nod to Sammy. There will also be a new standalone charger with 6A of current, that still operates at 95% efficiency at 3A. Qualcomm says their Quick Charge 4 standard will offer intelligent thermal balancing with high current charging handled on the companion chip. In the wake of the concerns about exploding smartphone batteries that caused the recall of the discontinued Samsung Galaxy Note 7 this year, Qualcomm made an effort to promote the many safety features and improvements it's putting into devices that will support Quick Charge 4. Both the smartphone and its power adapter will feature protections against higher temperatures, currents, and voltage. Qualcomm added that it is adding an extra layer of protection to, quote, help prevent battery overcharging and regulate current throughout every charge cycle, unquote. Sensors and monitors will be put in the chip, battery, and PMIC for keeping things cool. Now the question is, when will you be able to get your hands on a Quick Charge 4 compatible device? Sometime in the first half of 2017. No brainer there. But the real question is, how will this change your behavior with your smartphone? Could be pretty big. I mean, for me, I got two charges in my bedroom, two in the car, at least one on my computer, and I'm always charging every chance I get, trying to keep it between 10 and 90% ideally, because I'm a bit geeky that way. But with this, only five minutes of charging, I can keep one in my bag and just have one and not worry about it. How will this change your behavior? Let me know in the comments below. I know there are some serious battery geeks out there. Come on, geekies. Let's hear what you think.